Hi guys, it's Avantika. Welcome to Aviation Channel. It's my first video, and for today we will cover the topic principle of flight. हम धीरे-धीरे aviation related सभी topic cover करेंगे. So let's start our first topic, principle of flight, which tells you the basic concept of flight. That on which principle flight or aircraft works or fly. Okay. So first we will cover main four forces acted on aircraft in air. ठीक है सबसे पहले हम कंसीडर करेंगे स्ट्रेट एंड लेवल फ्लाइट विथ कांस्टेंट एल्टीट्यूड एंड स्पीड तो फर्स्ट क्योंकि हमारे एयरक्राफ्ट के बॉडी एक मास कंसिस्ट करती है तो डेफिनेटली उसका एक वेट होगा सो दैट फर्स्ट फोर्स इज वेट ड्यू टू ग्रेविटी वो हमेशा डाउनवर्ड डायरेक्शन में ही होगी क्योंकि हमें अपने एयरक्राफ्ट को हवा में फ्लाई करना है तो हमें वेट के काउंटर में अपर डायरेक्शन में एक फोर्स अप्लाई करना पड़ता है विच इज नोन एज ए लिफ्ट so this lift is generally produced by the difference in air pressure under and above wing और ये air pressure difference wing के shape की वजह से generate होता है that shape is airfoil shape okay what is airfoil shape ये हम आगे cover करेंगे now third force is thrust thrust is mechanical force generated by engine for propels aircraft in forward direction okay and now as we know कि aircraft moves in air and air is a fluid so definitely it will resist to motion of aircraft and this resistance force is known as a drag i hope ab aapko thrust and drag clear ho gaya hoga the thrust is used to overcome drag of an aircraft okay now we have some important definition and terms jo mostly aviation mein use hote hain so first is aerofoil what is aerofoil it's just a body design or shape jo screen mein abhi hame dikh raha hai airfoil is produced more lift than drag okay so The typical aerofoil section is no camber on top and more or less straight at the bottom. Okay. Second is leading edge. हमें नाम से ही पता चल रहा है that it is the edge कुछ lead कर रहा है. So this part is known as the leading edge. Same as this, the tail part is known as the trailing edge. Okay. Now another is chord line. So it's a joining the center of curvature. of leading edge to the trailing edge of an airfoil this is a imaginary line what is chord length it's simply the length of chord line is known as a chord length okay another important definition is angle of attack so as you can see on the screen that angle between chord line and relative airflow is known as a angle of attack so another term is stall stall is a condition in aerodynamics for aviation where the angle of attack increases beyond a certain point then lift started decreases the certain point is known as a critical angle of attack okay so simply due to above critical angle the air flow started separated as this way so is red part mein turbulence create hota hai and is area ka air pressure increase ho jata hai and that's why flight started moves downward direction due to this reverse air pressure difference okay so that's all for today's video in this video i tried to give you some basic information about principle of flight hum next video mein se continue karenge and air foil and types of air foil ko brief mein samjhenge because this is the main term behind the generating lift so i hope ye video aapko pasand aaya ho so please like share and subscribe kare